Hey everyone, it's Helga or Pudding Fish Cakes here, and today I'll be showing you all how to make two different polymer clay bananas, one kawaii version and one realistic version. Also, stay tuned till the end of this video for how to enter my giveaway of craft supplies. So let's get started with the realistic banana. First, take some white polymer clay and soften it with your hands. Add a tiny bit of yellow clay so you end up with an off-white shade. Take some of that clay and roll it into a banana shape by tapering the ends like so. Smooth it all out and keep it a little curved. For the banana peels, roll out a sheet of yellow clay. Then do the same with some white clay and stack those on top of each other. Using a craft knife, carefully cut out three of these pointed leaf shapes that are about the same length as your banana. Now we're going to attach these onto the banana. Pinch them along the bottom half and smooth it out until the entire bottom is covered. Then peel back the clay and shape them however you'd like. I like to make mine a little bit curly so they have some character to it. Next, take a needle tool or toothpick and add some texture onto the peels and the banana. I also used the bristles of a toothbrush to add some more texture. And that's it for the clay part. Let's put that aside and start the kawaii banana. The process is pretty similar, but we're just going to make everything a little bit rounder and of course add that iconic kawaii face. Start off with your off-white clay and create a little ovally shape like so. The rounder it is, the cuter it'll be. Stack your yellow and white clay and cut out three circular petal shapes and keep them about the same length. Attach these on like you did with the previous banana. Curve them outward and let's make the kawaii face. First, take a dotting tool and indent where the eyes will be. Roll out two tiny spheres of black clay and add those on. Roll out a thin strand of black clay and cut out a portion for the mouth. Use a dotting tool to help you attach and shape the smile. Then add some pink clay for the blush. Add some eye pins if you'd like to turn these into charms and they're ready to be baked. Bake 
make your pieces by following the instructions on your clay package. I'm baking mine at 270 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 minutes. Once your clay is out of the oven and has completely cooled down, take some brown acrylic paint and paint on the brown spots for the realistic banana. Then I'm using the side of a toothpick and kind of scratching the paint while it's still wet so it's a bit more textured. And finally, once your paint has dried completely, add on a coat of glaze for a glossy shine. Once that's all dried, you're finished! Now for the moment you've all been waiting for, I'll be giving away all these items to one lucky winner who will be announced in my next video. All you have to do to enter is first, be subscribed to this channel, second, give this video a big thumbs up, and third, comment down below what your favorite fruit is and I might make that next. I'll also have the giveaway details listed in the description box below. Good luck and I will see y'all next time! Bye!